submit to your husband. What does it imply? Submit, okay, means somebody who has a power, who has authority, who has everything, yet willingly okay. gives it out. You have your values, you have your rule, you have everything. But when you're not decided, like, okay, I give it all up for, for the good of the family, that's what is submission. Trust me, you don't want your wife to be submissive. I always tell my nephews, nieces, who, or children, whatever, never marry a woman who is highly submissive. If your wife cannot make a decision, cannot use her mind, she's going to raise her children to be like that. And if your children cannot think for themselves, it's a very dangerous thing. Submission is understanding. What I, why am I saying understanding? It's not about understanding because you have to understand God himself that gave you the authority that this is your wife. A wife is not a slave to husband. But you should understand that this is what God wants from you. That is why the wife wants to submit to the husband. It's not because you are a man. She wants to buy a car. Yeah. But the man does not approve. Should she go ahead and buy the car? Because she needs the car. Uh, uh, because she needs that, That's what I'm saying now. See, that's the, what the I'm way, saying. The but need. the man, yeah. understand? Okay. The man, okay. for any reason, okay. do not approve mm -hmm. that the wife should buy a car. Mm -hmm. Okay. Should she go ahead and buy the car? No. They must wait. The two of them must wait until there has been an agreement. What do you think? There must be an agreement. Until she, should, there has been... she should wait. Yes. She should wait. Do you, yeah. are, do you agree? Um, let me give you an example. There's one woman that. Yes or no? Yeah. Yes, maybe. Maybe. Not maybe. Okay. Because that you know is, why I say that? that is, she can be very logical. No. Yeah.